Gamers, welcome back. I'm Rob. I'm a grandmaster level player at the game of Risk Global Domination, and today we are Blackberry Bonkers wearing a bucket hat. And we're gonna take you guys over to Rivertown Advanced, and we're gonna throw the Risk meta settings on this map. You guys, I have a dream of holding a honeypot on this map. There's a one point hold that separates the middle of the map, if you remember it correctly. Uh, ooh, okay, so we are the black player in the second to last position here. What do we have? For potential honeypots. Now, based on the blizzards that I see here, I think what the game plan is going to be is to take a cap somewhere that can ensure that we hold down uh, a crazy little honeypot and then use that bonus. These are the bonuses, by the way. Use that bonus to then push through every other area and then sit right here on the bridge on the center of the map. Now, I believe what I could do is I could probably use... Well, no, because then blue can roll me turn one. I was going to say... This one right here is pretty good for that. It would essentially guarantee that I get the slums, which is a plus four. Blue capping right there is pretty interesting. Um, what are my other options if I were to go for the left side of the board? Hmm, let me see. Yeah, so that doesn't work out anyway because now that's two players that could roll my one. That's not going to work for us. So then what? Maybe we could try this five. It would have easy access into the west roads. And it would also basically guarantee that I hold down a plus two in turn one, or maybe even I could I could go pop, pop, put some troops over there, and then get North Watch and Court District. I think we're going to try that. I think that our dream stays alive here with this cheeky plus five here. Yes, I like that. Okay, nice. So we've got an eight. We're in the second to last position. I hope everyone is doing well today, by the way. Let's go ahead and uh, write down what we can infer on the board, and then we will get into the rules and the players, and red bots out instantly. Okay. Um, so let's see. So we have blue over in Town Plaza. And then we did also see purple right next to them, right? We have purple where? In uh, the Mitri Tavern. Tavern. Okay, nice. And then white was a question mark. Oh, no, dude, we have so much activity on the right side of the board. That's perfect. Wait. You guys, this game might be legendary here because we have everybody going... F Dude, everyone's going to be fighting over the right side of the board, making themselves weak. One, two, three, four. Oh my gosh. Which means that it's just me and pink potentially, right? On the left side, maybe? Right? Because red flagged. So actually, I'm not even going to write down red's cap. Well, I do need to write it down as somebody else is going to grab it. But press uh, gangers in. Okay. Press gangers in... And then we need to pay close attention to Pink's turn. Um, I'm actually going to go out on a limb here, and I'm just going to say that, um, because we know that White had Fish Market, so I'm just going to say White has Fish Market and Press Gangers in. A very, very slim chance that White doesn't get that, unless maybe Blue rolls them or something, which could happen. Um, and then, yeah, and then it's really just Pink. That's a question mark. So if Pink flags, we know that we have this side of the board for free. Um, so I go off now this red uh, three is actually guarding me so I get a free pass so I just need to make sure that this is strong right I get two more troops I don't even need all those troops I'm gonna actually do it like this I have an idea oh yeah there's just a one back there okay so that takes care of that and then now I'm actually gonna bring this five up and out yeah, that's a pretty good defensive hold there. Um, if somebody goes through that red three, they will not have enough to roll my five cap. So we are actually totally chilling. Oh my god, we are totally chill. And pink is investing on the right side. Wait, all five other caps might be on the other side of the board. Are you joking? No way. I've never seen a game like this on Rivertown, ever. We might actually pull it off, dude. My dream of holding the entire side, either the left or the right. Which one's better? I'm curious. I think the right side's just a tiny bit better, right? Yeah, you got two plus fives, plus four. Yeah, it's close. Wow, but I'll take either side, man. And then just let me sit on the bridge. Oh, oh my God. Just let me sit on the bridge, dude. Everyone's going to be fighting. Eventually, somebody slams through another person. No way. I am actually mind blown. Okay, dude. So pink, I'm going to say pink is uh, just the slums. And then that's that's high confidence. Yeah. The slums, I'm still going to leave a question mark there. But they are the only cap that we don't know and they, they put everything down there. So that's high confidence, right? 
And then now what I'm going to do is this. Now I'm going to, so my five is still guarded. I'm going to put everything on this two, and I'm going to push through out here and then sit over here. And then maybe I bring this five up, and then I just want to sit on the road. <clears throat> Now, eventually, if somebody gets their cap taken, or if they want to try to hold a bonus somewhere else, we may start seeing people invest some troops over here, which could be bad. Um, but I think what I want, uh, maybe, maybe I leave this three here for one more turn as a guard, because I'm not able to take Mayor's District or the West Roads anyway. So really, all that does is weaken my cap. So I'm actually not going to take that. I'm going to put potentially everything on this two, and then just slam everything on the left side as soon as possible. And if I am uncontested, folks... Look, dude, I'm curious at the time you're watching this video, how long this video is. If it's a short one, goodness gracious, uh, I might literally destroy everyone. This could be insane. Uh, so yeah, everything's going down here. Ooh, we actually have a lot of action down here. Interesting. Okay, so I do actually get that. Um, yeah, I'm just going to take this slow, if that's the case. Move this three up here. Or this two, sorry, against the three. Um, let's get into the rules and the players, folks. So yes, I don't want to see you beef anything over here. Nothing. Hold on. Before I get into the rules and the players, I just want to verify that you make it out of your draft phase. Come on! Oh my god, you're so annoying. Alright, so I completely wipe you out. You don't have enough to remove me, and I will remove you. That is for sure. Ugh. Yeah, you're getting removed, Pink. Okay, so Pink, Pink is going to flag soon. Pink is going to flag soon. Um... So yeah, let's see. Uh, anyways, let's get into the rules and the players, folks. So yes, this is Rivertown Advanced, but we throw the risk meta settings on it, which I love doing. Um, it is, let's see, excuse me, uh, 60 second turn timer. The AI is set to expert if anybody bots out, but it is neutral AI. Progressive cards, bounce blitz dice. Anybody can play in this ranked game. Alliances are off. Fog of War on, blizzards are on, and portals are off. And you guys, I think at this point, I prefer the neutral AI. I have been absolutely loving it. It pushes games along. It prevents people from doing that weird thing where they like bought out to try to get a better placement or like they bought out and then they come back and then they bought out and they come back and they keep they keep tabs on the match to see if people will leave their bot alone, which is super shady. I've never done it once in my entire life. I I can't stand people that play like that. Um, so yeah, and the flagging, the neutral AI makes sure that whenever you flag, you legitimately get last place, which is how it should be if you leave the game. Um, I have been loving neutral AI. Okay, so uh, pink, super unfortunate for you. I'm not even going to slider that as a sign of disrespect. Okay, and then now I'm going to bring... Now, pink might flag after I did that, to be honest with you. They, they invested a lot of material over there. And um, now it's just gone. So, dude, okay, so we have white flagging, we have red flagging, and I can still see that somebody hasn't taken the uh, the fishing district, which is so interesting. And we saw that white was where? White was on, uh, yeah, fish market. So that means that blue probably has fish market. Uh, yeah, blue probably has fish market, right? That's what we think about that. So my next turn is very straightforward. You guys, I might even get the whole left side of the board before the first sets roll in. Holy shit. Wait, blue starting with what? Okay, so blue is the reason why white is botting out. Let's be sure to write that down. So I'm just going to say blue has Town Plaza, Fish Market, and Press uh, Gangers in. It will be me versus blue is how that's looking. So I'm going to remove white from my notes. And then we need to get into the rules and the players, or the, the players now that we've gotten into the rules. Okay, so yes, in the first position, we have the blue player who we are predicting to uh, snowball the right side. And they are from Kenya. Um, Alster Litz, 53. In the second position, we have the purple player, Alvin Calaveras, and the purple player is from Spain. In the third position, we have the uh, white player who's from the Netherlands. Dude, we are all over the world in this game. Uh, check yourself before Zizek yourself? What does that even mean? Did I just say something that's offensive? I don't even know. Uh, in the fourth position, we have the red player, Stonewall II, who is now flagged. In the fifth position, we have your boy, Blackberry Bonkers, wearing a bucket hat. A Grandmaster, a.k.a. Robo. Uh, in the final position, we have the pink player, General Flank, who is very upset at me. Or unfortunate for the pink player, for sure. Um, so I'm actually going to do it like this. I'm going to see how far I can go through everything. I'm going to slider everything and see if I can just grab all of these bonuses. Uh, so I have to do it in a kind of annoying way. Uh, damn it. Well, then I at least can do it like this. 
the four there. Holy shit, I'm about to be a problem on the map. Holy shit. Uh... Ah, 28%. I have time. Nice! Wow, I got really good usage out of that, didn't I? Oh my god! Oh my god! Has the, 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 oh, the first set did happen. Holy shit, well, I have a set. If somebody, if Blue wants to try to do something about that, I got bad news for them, man. I got really bad news for them. Uh, Blue might, though. Blue might, but I, dude, I just have so much territory. What is that? Oh my god, look at it. Holy shit. I mean, it's not exactly sitting on the bridge, but my goodness. Okay, so Blue has 10. Maybe they do push through, but dude, What? Look at this. This is the start of the game. I was completely uncontested. What is everybody doing, dude? What are you guys doing? What in the world? Let's see if Blue makes it out of their draft phase without doing anything over here. And then I need to make sure that... Okay, so Market Street was one of the things, right? Uh... Uh, no, it was Fish Market Town Plaza. Okay, so I can, I can take right here, and I'm fine. Wow. Okay, so you set, you get the six. That's still not enough to do anything to me. Um, and you're gonna clear out, you're gonna get all of these kills. You're gonna get you're gonna get all these kills before you can even do anything. Wait, hold on. I may just go through and push through right now. Holy shit. Oh my god, we're ten minutes into this game. And I've got the left side of the board done. I wonder if blue made themselves so weak that I can grab a, a meaningful cap. Yeah, because purple's gonna cause problems for them too. Leader is three out of six. Let's keep our eye on that. Um, I don't even need a set. I, I basically have a set right here. Oh my goodness gracious, and now I'm gonna sit here. Yeah, good luck, Blue, holy shit. Holy shit, good luck. Um, and then I'm just gonna leave, I'm, I'm just gonna move one of these threes over here to uh, my cap. Just in case they go looking and uh, they know exactly where to look. I just wanna make sure that that is okay. Um, but dude, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Look at us. Oh my god, we are going to be such a problem for Blue, dude. We are actually going to be such a problem for Blue. That's insane. I mean, oh my goodness gracious, dude. That's, I, I mean, I've got I've to remove my camera just to marvel at this. That is beautiful. This one's been on the bucket list too for me, man, is like conquering this map. But dude, to do it in this dominant of a fashion is just blowing my mind. I cannot believe that we did that. You're going to have to smack me. Yeah. Oh, good game. Yep, that's good game. And I have a set too. Oh my God, do I just end the game right here? This may be one of the most dominant games I have ever played. Holy shit, I'm going to end the game right here, I think. I'm going to go for it, man. I'm going to try to kill everyone right here. Hold on. Start with blue. Oh my god. Uh, yeah, I'll just see this one through real quick. Okay, well that's red. And then I found you. Oh my goodness gracious. Wait, is this even going to be a 20 minute video? Uh, pink. So that takes care of pink there, and then I go through and I do a little wrap around here, put four there, put the rest right here. Shit. Okay, and then now pink has to go through right there, so then I'm just going to move this 10 to be about right there. <laughs> Dude, what is this game? Uh, dude, I'm actually mind blown. This is one of the most dominant performances I've ever had on a map. And it was just because everyone fought for the other side of the board that I did not go for. What? Oh, dude, good game. You have no shot. Do I have a set? Uh, I don't have a set on four, but I essentially have a set because look at my bonuses. <laughs> dude. Oh my God, you're so toast. You're so toast. Oh my gosh. Are we going to be able to get this video to 20 minutes? I don't, I don't think so. I don't think so. 
Oh, Pink, you need a miracle. Pink, you need a miracle here. Oh, you're not going to get it. Oh, Pink. Oh, you're not going to get it. 52. Wow. Oh, you're not going to get it, Pink. And then that sets me. You are toast. You are so toast. Uh, I don't know if I'll be able to get the, the World Dom and the Capital Conquest victory, though. I don't think so. Can I get it at the exact same time? I think I can, folks. Oh my goodness. The most dominant game. Dude, I can't remember the last time I had a game more dominant than that. Oh, well, actually, you know what? We do have to hit him. Dude, we've got to do it. We've got to hit him with the good game and the well played, the GGs and the fist bump, you guys. Rivertown advance. Wow, less than 20 minutes. Dude, I'm mind blown. B dude, Blackberry Bonkers wearing the bucket hat picks up the W there. And what is. Maybe top three most dominant games I have ever played, defeating uh, three beginners and expert. And blue was a grand master, folks. We took down a grand master in that one. Wow! More daily risk videos on the way very soon. That was a quick one, dude. Holy shit! Um, I will see you guys on the next one.